NASCAR Racing on TSN is brought to you by Canadian Tire, the official automotive retailer of NASCAR in Canada for days like today. Andrew Ranger has been presented with the checkered flag as he makes his way around coming out of turn three up through four and now continues his victory lap and uh, during the break I said to you Ron he is really one cool driver when you think back to the way that race started the pressure he was under the way that car wouldn't behave for him whatever he did make the adjustments or let the car come back boy he's something yeah he, it, Andrew is a, is a great talent he for uh, for a young man of 22 or 23 he has a tremendous amount of experience and, and has a great future um, he's doing uh, doing a great job in the K&N series um, and hopefully we'll see him in uh, hopefully we'll see him in the nationwide series our, our paths will cross in August for sure absolutely as he runs in Montreal sponsored by the Dodge dealers of Quebec as he'll make his way into victory lane and then what about J.R. Fitzpatrick I mean he was challenging him then we don't know if it was in fact oil that got him but maybe a slight mistake under braking after all that yeah, J.R. Fitzpatrick uh, really did run a very good race, very competitive. He pressured the 27. Really, the only other car today that had anything for Andrew Ranger was J.R. Fitzpatrick, but unfortunately uh, could be motor woes by, uh, on the 84 that, uh, that laid down that oil slick, but J.R. Fitzpatrick uh, not getting the finish that he deserved uh, coming home in eighth position. And third place going to the invader, Jason Bowles, who survived a little late bumper bashing dj kennington thompson jr in fourth as we once again say hello to Todd. andrew rangers just pulled into victory circle here in toronto he's going to get a much deserved cold drink and andrew rangers going to take a second to unclip the radio unbuckle his helmet and pull that off also pulling off the cool hose that is hopefully trying to keep him a little bit cool during this race and You'll see the smile of satisfaction come across his face momentarily. We've seen it. This will be for the 10th time now here in the NASCAR Canadian Tire Series. He was on a mission and focused earlier this week, and he had a task in front of him to win here. First time that the NASCAR Canadian Tire Series has raced on the streets of Toronto, and Andrew Ranger has been uh, successful in that mission. As you guys have detailed, he's not running a full season this year, but the want to win is still there for Andrew in his country. He mentioned to me earlier today that he loves coming to Toronto. He enjoys this city very much and, and celebrate on the streets of Toronto with a victory the first time around. Andrew, the, the smile says it all on your face. That is a big smile of satisfaction. Exactly. Thank you very much. I want to thank the fans. Thank to uh, TSN. Uh, my team, I want to thank Dave Jacobs. I'm bored with we'll Dodge. Thank you very much for supporting me this year. It's something where I'm really happy. I want to thank you know my crew. They work so hard, and they give me a really good car like that. It's fantastic. Andrew, you talked about uh, earlier in this this day that you mentioned that your car took a lap or two to come to you. It was a little bit slippery, a little bit tough to handle. We saw that as J.R. Fitzpatrick really seemed to push you on a couple of occasions, and literally once, but you managed to hold them off for the whole race. Yeah, my car was really fast in the beginning. I was able to pull away, uh, but uh, after the restart, my car was struggling a little bit more, and J.R. was riding and back me. He pushed me a little bit in one corner, uh, but uh, the last restart, he did a mistake. It was really, really uh, slippery. But uh, at the end, you know, we won. It's fantastic. Thank you very much. Andrew Ranger, congratulations. Winner as the NASCAR Canadian Tire races here on the streets of Exhibition Place on the Jumpstart 100 for the first time. We'll be back with more. We'll talk to second place, third place, and see what happened to J.R. Fitzpatrick as well here at Exhibition Place in Toronto in just a moment. The jump start 100 from Exhibition Place in Toronto and Andrew Ranger leads from start to finish but not before he has to survive a green white checker and lots of pressure from J.R. Fitzpatrick. Fitzpatrick going out on the last lap allowing Jason Bowles the American invader to come up to take second ahead of the current championship leader D.J. Kennington. Jason Bowles is with Todd. Jason, Jason is just getting some congratulations from the team. Looked like you were going to have a podium finish, which is pretty satisfying, but then you got a bonus spot at the end of this one. Yeah, you know, I uh, one corner before uh, uh, JR made a mistake there. I made a mistake and hit the tires a little bit, and then I, 
I was fortunate that DJ had made a mistake the corner before that, so I had a little gap, and JR uh, just overshot the breaking zone with a couple corners to go, and we got a little bit of a bonus. But I think we were probably as good as JR. We just we couldn't get going good on the short runs. It took us too long to get going. They just have a gap, and we just didn't have the time to, to make it back up. But the guys from Gaunt Brothers Racing, Marty Gaunt, and everybody did a great job. I really, really appreciate everything they've done. The Rusty Wallace Racing experience on board this week. Um, you know, I, I can't thank everybody enough for what a great job they did. And, you know, hopefully we're going to go to Montreal and we'll be a little bit better and see if we can put it up one, for, one more spot. Says a lot about the performance of this team and the chemistry that's come together so quickly. Second race in this car for this team and two podium finishes. That's pretty, pretty outstanding. Yeah, we're getting better every week. You know, we finally had a chance to test before this race and we made some improvements and now we know what we got to work on a little bit more. This is our first time going to a street course, so it's definitely a little bit different with no pit stop, no strategy. So uh, I'm really looking forward to going to Montreal, though. We should be good. Uh, Jason Bowles with a second place finish here in Toronto, Vic, and pretty satisfying effort for the young man. Well, absolutely. Third at most part, second here. Three, two, will it be a one in Montreal? This is the Jumpstart 100. The Jumpstart 100 has been brought to you by Castrol. Visit us at changeyouroilchangeyourlife.com. By Leland Industries, quality fasteners, quality service, driven to win. And by Ultimate Drivers, driving school that makes a difference. For franchise information across Canada, check out ultimatedrivers.ca. Reminder, coming up on Sunday, the track heats up. Here in Toronto, as TSN2 brings you exclusive coverage of the 2010 Honda Indy Toronto. Coverage begins at 12.30 Eastern, 9.30 a.m. Pacific. And if you're in the area, tickets are still available. DJ Kennington, the points leader, finishes in third place. And Todd, I think you'd be happy with that. Uh, DJ Kennington looks very happy with it. You said earlier that if you had a top five finish, that's a solid points day. It would feel good. You got a couple spots better. Podium finish. This role for you this year keeps going. Absolutely. I just got to thank Castrol Edge and Mopar Dodge, Hitachi Power Tools, Mahindra Tractors, everybody out there. My dad, he made a motor he put in there today. Unbelievable. And uh, just very, very fortunate. And the two that beat us really don't matter right now. And uh, they're great road racers. And we'll take that run and uh, have a good point play here today and head on to Edmonton. Uh, the smile says uh, this feels like a win for you. You've had a couple already this year, and the role, as I mentioned, keeps going. You were so focused on this championship from day one this year. Yeah, we want it really bad, I'm telling you. My guys, Whitey and, and Sammy and Spud and Charlie, all the guys, I mean, it's it's just unbelievable how much they're digging in, and uh, i got to thank them all. My dad works his butt off, and my whole family, my mom, everybody. I mean, you can't thank everybody that you have to, but uh, we're on a roll, and we're going to try to keep this going all the way out to Edmonton. Thanks, DJ. The family business doing well in 2010, Vic. Andrew Ranger picks up a 10th win in 40 career starts, and seven of those 10 have now come on. Road courses, Jason Bull second, followed by Kennington Thompson Jr. Kerry Mix was in the middle of it all, the, all day, and Trevor Siebert finishes sixth. Jeff Lapsovich, a two-time winner here in Cascar, finishes in seventh. Now on behalf of Ron Fellows, of Dave Bradley, Todd Lewis, our entire crew, Thank you for joining us. The Jump Start 100, the NASCAR Canadian Tire Series presented by Mobile One on Canada's sports leader, TSN.